another two coyote video and it was high April fields, but this one's a little bit different. It's two different hunts, same exact location. When I take one out of a double, so I'm, I see two coyotes and I take one out of there. The next time I go back, I'm going to key on that maybe a little bit different time. So in this video, I've gone to an area where I see coyotes in there a lot feeding. They, they move through this area a lot. I'll call and I'll see them in there and I'll move into that area. And I've seen them enter from a large woodlot that I cannot hunt, but they enter the field right here in this one area. And they're always looking around feeding in this area. So went down there the other night. I did ace interrogation how went into a little bit of vol squeaks and I had one come out and I was watching it. It was a little bit far. I was determining if I was going to shoot or not. It's, there's an elevation change a little bit and I was going to shoot downhill. I'm debating whether to take the shot in the high weeds or maybe try and call in. And the second one came out into my field of view, turned and looked back at me and I took a shot. It ran down a little ways and it went down. So that was that first harvest of the two the second one left I stayed there a little bit longer but it never came back in half an hour so that was one of the areas I want to key in on when I go the next time so the next hunt which was going to be last night I went in there I know they entered that woodlot right there early so I'm there about 10 o'clock 9 30 10 o'clock put the Icatech out and I go into bull squeaks mouse chatter and then the last one, whenever I, I finally got it to come in, I went a little bit louder on rat distress. I'm looking over to the woodlot to my left and waiting for him to come there. But this coyote was already out in the field that early. And I looked over to my right and I made a move. I know the coyote seen me move, but it didn't know exactly what I was. I got to focus in. I got to change my focus a little bit. Put it right in the, in the chest of this one and dropped it right there. So out of that group, I took two out of that group, but in different nights. I just wanted to talk about that a little bit, a tactic. I always go back for that second one within days. The very next hunt, I'm in there because I know it's in the area. It's going to come into calling a little bit better because it may be looking for its buddy. So we dropped two. Man, we're approaching 50 kills here really quickly before April's over. We're going to get that 100 for the year. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. We've got many more coming in these high fields in April. Before they cut the fields, we're going to keep hitting these high fields and keep bringing you this action.